Welcome back, this is Random Gamer. In this video we'll build the steel production factories, we also work on the central storage facility. The complete list of all of the mods used in this gameplay alongside with mod spotlights are in the video description. Note that I updated the game to 3.5 presumably and also a bunch of mods have been updated. Also the mod versions have been modified in the video description. I provide weekly gaming content in YouTube for free. I would be forever grateful if you could check out my merch. Only a small percentage of people that watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you end up liking the video, smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm and consider subscribing. It's free and you can always change your mind. Enjoy the video. Alright, so to begin with, let's do some MAM research. Let's start with the inflated pocket dimension under uh, Alien Organisms tab, so we can unlock 5 inventor slots. And meanwhile, let's choose another milestone to work for. Let's do the programmable elevators, so we can uh, build the elevator uh, right beside the hub over here. And while we wait for that, let's choose another one and uh, gather the resources needed for that. Alright, all done, let's start another one. Oh my! I got the fist! That's rare indeed. So, the mem has been also doing its thing and uh, finished. So, uh, let's choose another one. Let's do the medicinal inhalers next. Okay, the next thing uh, requires steel already, so uh, I think we should uh, get on that. So uh, we should have uh, been able, we should be able to, uh, let's see, uh, smelter, yeah, daisy chain the smelters. So, uh, so yeah, let's, uh, let's do that. Uh, let's choose a location to put the steel factory in and uh, then route the coal uh, from the deposit uh, somewhere over there to our uh, factory and also the iron ore we must uh, i think we must uh, uh, use another ore for that fortunately we have another one right over there and and yeah let's uh, let's build a building for this steel production we're still producing uh, quite a bit of uh, power so i think we don't need to uh, use the coal power yet because uh, yeah, we have our nifty refined power. So I thought of uh, building the steel production, steel ingot production over here. Steel rods, uh, oh steel beams I think, uh, was it? Mm, let's see, steel, yeah steel pipes over here and beams over there. So uh, we have the steel production in one place. All right, so let's uh, get on it. So first of all, the steel production itself. I'll build a temporary MAM uh, just near our build site. Check on the research uh, and there we have it. We have the medicinal inhaler unlocked. So let's see about the next one. Let's do the color cartridge uh, which only uses, which only takes 3 seconds. Perfect. Let's also do the yellow power shards uh, uh, research which unlocks uh, power shards. And let's also do the slug scanning next, and after that this one, and after that this one. Alright, perfect, and uh, the overclocking next. Alright, one building done, two to go. Alright, the analysis is complete, let's uh, do another one. So, uh, power slugs, the purple one, three seconds, so done it is. Uh, let's start with the sulfur tree now. Three seconds. Perfect. Alright, so the next one, okay, it needs 50 sulfur, 25 coal. Don't have that at the moment. So let's see what we can do uh, over here. Okay, three seconds. We can unlock the silica. And let's see about this, these ones. Uh, not yet. These ones also not yet. Uh, okay, so let's see. We can do the AI limiter. Three seconds. 
All right, perfect. All right, so uh, the next one uh, needs oil uh, within the plastic. We don't have that at the moment, so AI limiters also uh, are needed at the moment to create the smart splitter. All right, so um, let's see. So at the moment, I think this is it. Uh, we have uh, ev everything researched that we can at the moment. So, so yeah, uh, I didn't need uh, basically any of those uh, at the moment, but uh, I'd like to uh, research uh, things that I can, so we can uh, progress uh, within the MEM research uh, also. And uh, and yeah, so let's continue with uh, building the um, buildings. Ran out of the concrete and uh, our plates. Oh, forgot that I had the map uh, also mini map. So uh, let's let's move it to the right place. All right, perfect. So let's grab some concrete. Uh, let's grab like 500 and some uh, reinforced. Uh, no. The regular uh, iron plates also should be over here. 500 of these also. Very convenient indeed. Alright, perfect. Three buildings uh, have been built and also powered up. Uh, so now let's continue with the progression of uh, delivering resources over here. So let's uh, drive over there and uh, and yeah go up to the coal deposits. So the coal was uh, was located 400 meters over there. So let's bring the... Oh, uh, yeah, had too many resources on us. Uh, so uh, so let's dump, dump some stuff over here. Uh, like one stack of... Uh, one, not, not all, but one stack of concrete. And grab the rest of the fuel. And build the uh, oh not not that one <laughs> this is the wrong one oh we should uh, also build the elevator hmm yeah let's do that before uh, delivering the coal even all right so organization uh, programmable elevator mark one where and how can we build it I have uh, used this mod uh, before. But yeah I don't uh, remember exactly so uh, so let's see so. So let's remove the old setup uh, which ho uh, held the uh, jump pads and uh, let's try to build the elevator somewhere here. Alright, managed to submerge uh, the uh, smallest foundation inside of the world. So uh, we can build the elevator uh, right on it. So uh, yeah, I think the door should be orientated to here. Let's see, eh? nice. So, uh, so now what? So configure. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So 40 meters is max at the moment. All right. So let's see uh, how much uh, we must elevate that. Mm, yeah, this should be uh, okay. So the ground floor uh, I will keep uh, as is, and the factory floor is is the floor we are at at the moment. So uh, let's see if the uh, down, uh, the li lift goes down as well. Perfect. Very nice indeed. So we have two options now: to use the elevator or to uh, use the jump pad over here. Uh, not jump pad, but the uh, uh, chilly landing pad. So I think, uh, yeah, I will remove the uh, jump pad over here because, uh, yeah, it has uh, been. The, the first part of it has been already removed to make room for the elevator. So yeah, perfect. So uh, let's go and uh, and uh, and yeah, uh, ride with our elevator, brand new elevator. So the Mark Two and the Mark Three, I think, uh, only changes changes the max height. Uh, oh, the mediums. Oh yeah, the speed also is uh, an option. So let's uh, let's see about the express one. So is this? Yeah, this is uh, this is better. I think the uh, next one, the warp is too fast. Yeah, it's basically teleport. So yeah, uh, let's keep it as express. And and yeah, 
we can al always uh, change it if we if we need it, need to. So yeah, let's um, let's check on uh, our inventory if we can find uh, the right button. Uh, what the hell I'm doing? The tab. Okay. So uh, we have. Yeah, I think we have uh, enough of resources. Oh, we should. Uh, bring more reinforced iron plates in order to uh, bring the coal uh, over here. So yeah, let's uh, switch up the inventory a bit. Let's dump uh, unnecessary things over here. And and yeah, be right back. Yeah, it's getting quite tedious uh, running back and forth uh, to our uh, storage facility. Uh, we should definitely look into uh, having teleporters. So we have the mod for it, but yeah, I don't remember uh, when uh, it's unlocked, so yeah. So let's grab some uh, reinforced iron plates, if you can uh, find them, let's run in circles for a while. Alright, so they're here, so let's see how much we have, okay, quite nice, and also the dispenser is full of it, so yeah. Let's grab like, in total of 1000 of them, and then let's uh, return to our uh, thing. Let's use our brand new elevator to go down. Uh, not not like that, but uh, like that. And let's build the uh, nifty explorer we unlocked previously. Let's fuel it up. All right, and uh, put some of them in here, and let's roll. Yeah, definitely uh, a lot more fun way to travel while in the explorer so we can yeah we can't uh, scan for the coal uh, whilst inside of the uh, explorer but now it should work yeah so 200 meters over there let's uh, let's jump for it and let's hope we don't die ah that took a bit of damage but no worries all right the coal is here so let's uh, set up a miner. There we have it. So uh, let's uh, hook it up to our factory now. Let's see where should we bring it in. Yeah, I think uh, right beside the. Uh, uh, what? What? Where? Where they even? Uh, limestone, yeah, and the uh, quartz. So uh, right over there should be fine. All right. So connect it up. Uh, let's power the miner now. We can again use the wind turbines for that. Uh, I think we can use about two of them. Uh, let's see. So one here and one there. Can it? Uh, yeah, it can reach. Perfect. So uh, we're do producing ten each. So twenty megawatts, and this only uses five. So perfect. Uh, so we have coal coming in now. Yes, indeed. So 120 coal is being delivered. So let's get back up there and let's uh, bring it to the factory and also uh, let's check on our uh, iron uh, delivery also. So let's remove the uh, temporary constructors which we used for uh, the quartz. Uh, uh, not the quartz, but yeah, quartz crystals. All right, coal has been routed all the way up there. I also used the, uh, not used, but built the uh, other conveyor line over here for the iron delivery. So let's go back down there and uh, use our nifty uh, elevator. Perfect. And uh, let's uh, use the uh, ore over here to dedicate for steel production. Okay, I think we can remove the uh, biomass burners now. Yeah, we definitely don't need those uh, anymore. So, thank you for your service. Um, so now, let's route the uh, iron ore up there. And there we have it, iron is connected. Damn, I love this elevator. So, uh, I routed it around here. And, and, oh, we need to connect it up over here also. Perfect. So uh, now we should be getting iron and coal. Oh yeah. A bit of clipping, but uh, yeah. Uh, let's uh, ignore that. 
we when we have uh, ore gliding through it then we don't uh, notice it all right so uh, let's uh, build the smelting setup now over there okay i think i need to remove this uh, tree down below so uh, so yeah let's uh, go down here and equip our beloved chainsaw all right now we should be good all right so let's uh, build the smelting setup I missed the elevator. Oh well. Let's uh, let's try right again then. Let's try to use the elevator as it's supposed to be used. Hmm. Works like a charm. Thank you. Just uh, was running over here to a stock up stock up on uh, reinforced iron blades, but yeah, managed to die. All right, the production is running, so um, had to do uh, a bit of uh, janky thing over here, but uh, all turned out, turned out to be uh, pretty nice. So 90 degree angles uh, all around, and yeah, uh, splitting up the uh, uh, iron ore and coal uh, to each side. So definitely uh, not enough of uh, ore is being uh, provided but yeah it uh, looks cool to uh, use the whole uh, floor space uh, indeed and and yeah that future in the future definitely we will use uh, all of these melters so yeah it uh, merges up uh, into the middle and uh, we don't have an uh, usage for that uh, ingot yet but uh, we will definitely so over here we will uh, build the steel beam and steel uh, pipes I mean and over there the steel beams production so let's get uh, on it alrighty then there we have it uh, we have the steel pipes production uh, uh, in the making uh, not in the making but uh, yeah we have uh, pipes being produced uh, as you can see from here uh, at the moment uh, we are not routing them uh, to anywhere but yeah uh, for now uh, That'll do. Uh, basically, we will split it up even more from here to route uh, one uh, set of uh, steel ingots to the uh, steel beam production and one to the central storage facility. So let's uh, build the uh, beam facility, so uh, the beam uh, production lines. So uh, exactly the same setup as in here. So, uh, so let's get to it. And there we have it, splitting the uh, ingots uh, production over here, so we can use them uh, in our brand new steel beams factory. So basically the same, uh, exactly the same setup as in the uh, pipes. Uh, we are definitely not uh, delivering enough of uh, steel uh, ingots at the moment, but, uh, that, but it will do uh, for our needs uh, at the moment. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, let's also now route the steel ingots from there, uh, also coal uh, from the same location, and uh, the beams and uh, the uh, pipes to the central storage facility. All right, the pipes and the beams were uh, very easy to connect indeed. And just uh, split it over here, not split even, uh, I directly routed it over here. So perfect, uh, perfect routing over here, so uh, so no worries there. Um, let's continue with the steel uh, ingots and coal now. Alright, so the steel ingots and the coal is also being routed. Uh, I routed it uh, from here and, and they... Uh, stumbled on a on a pickle again so uh, basically we have run out of uh, uh, storage containers in the first floor so we have delivered uh, 24 uh, i don't remember even did they have 18 or yeah basically the first floor is full of uh, items so uh, we need to um, expand our storage facility upwards so uh, the coal is uh, waiting over here so let's uh, 
Let's go to the second floor and, and start building the storage container setup. Uh, also, let's build a elevator over here. Uh, I'm uh, kind of tired uh, always walking up here. So uh, let's see if we have uh, the uh, resources for it. Yeah, so let's remove the ladder. We have uh, had enough of this ladder. So let's see where should we build. I think over here. So, oh, the door is, is the wrong orientation. Okay. So about here. Okay. We definitely need to build some uh, foundations with the frames, for example, to make it look uh, a bit more realistic. So the elevator could like um, climb uh, on it. So, so let's see. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven times four is twenty-eight. Uh, so it's twenty-eight. So let's go. Uh, all right. Okay. The <laughs> the door is uh, orientated the wrong way now. Um. Hmm, how, how do we uh, solve this issue? So let's, for for the moment, okay, can we even uh, build? Uh, yeah, no. Let's, okay, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. This isn't going to work like that. So uh, let's just try to orientate the elevator uh, so we can go in uh, from the back uh, at the moment. We will come up with a solution uh, later. I think uh, uh, there are a couple of elevators uh, in the next years which are uh, accessible in uh, more than one ways. So yeah, okay, let's um, let's try it now. So uh, okay, did it remember now? Mm, okay, so we have the twenty-eight. Okay, um, so one meter, I think more. Uh, right, perfect. All right, now we have a way, a better way to get up, I think. So this one also needs to be uh, an elevator now. So let's tear up this one and and, uh, and replace it with an elevator. Okay, managed to uh, add an elevator over here, but yeah, it, this setup setup isn't perfect at the moment because uh, we only have uh, three floors available. So this is the basement, this is the first floor, and this is the second one we need to uh, get to, get to working on. But yeah, we cannot uh, travel any further because we don't have any floors left to add. So uh, uh, I think we need to. Uh, Add another another elevator to reach uh, up top there at the moment. So uh, and also let's add some uh, guardrails uh, over here, just in case uh, when the elevator isn't here, we don't fall uh, down so easily. So yeah. All right, uh, made made something. So uh, let me take you to the full journey. So uh, basement is over here, first floor over here, second floor over here, and there we go. To the second elevator which is over here and let's go to the third floor and to the fourth floor which is basically the roof i will keep the ladder at the moment so yeah so yeah uh, we don't have uh, so much much business up there at the moment all right so uh, we have the elevator set up so uh, let's let's go to the second floor now and start uh, building the storage containers and uh, so forth I'm having uh, quite a lot of trouble uh, aligning the regular item dispensers over here because uh, because yeah it's it's a circular building so let's use the mini dispensers instead so uh, they look pretty nice and uh, I think they will uh, definitely make our life a bit easier so uh, we only need to remove this one over here and it should be alrighty then Let's see. Yeah, perfect. So let's do this all around. All right, perfect. All connected up. Uh, also connected up these conveyors over here. So now we have to do the most uh, tedious thing of all. Uh, 
uh, do the routing of the uh, conveyor lifts outside. So yeah. Hmm, let's uh, think of a way even. Uh, let's go outside from here. Alright, so... Um, okay, let's let's try to do something then. I constructed a temporary platform over here just to build the uh, conveyor poles and connect the conveyors. And then uh, I will delete them and, and take it from there. Alright, uh, I think I managed to uh, copy the uh, previous uh, result. So, uh, so yeah, uh, let's continue uh, building the next ones. So this is the first uh, one which was completed already. And this is the one I just did at the moment. So uh, just connect it up uh, from the bottom, uh, reach reach up here and bring it up uh, down there. And, and yeah, no worries whatsoever. So... Uh, I think while we're up here doing that, uh, let's connect up the uh, third floor also. So then we have uh, everything done with this uh, storage facility uh, regarding the outer uh, conveyors, uh, so far at least. So the third floor is uh, pretty much the same, only difference is uh, that this one is uh, five long, not three. So one, two, three, four. Four and five. So uh, let's connect up uh, these and and yeah. So connecting up the second and third floor looks something like this. It can be done from the floor over here. You have to have a quite nice perception of, of how far it is. This should be all right. And now the next one over here. So and the third floor connect it up over here so let me see yeah this one should be okay and now okay the conveyor belt is on the way a bit so but but the example is basically like that so yeah so let's do this uh, all around <laughs> While building this, uh, I have used up uh, all of my reinforced iron blades. Uh, fortunately, I should have enough uh, for now. So I have used only, uh, not only, but uh, I have used over uh, like uh, 2000 or something. So, uh, so yeah, uh, no, not that one. Factory floor. Thank you. So let's continue connecting these up. So guess what? Two reinforced iron plates were uh, over the budget basically. So, <laughs> so yeah, used up uh, all of my reinforced iron plates. So, so this uh, this is quite expensive uh, build, so to say even. Uh, let's check uh, our reinforced iron plate production because uh, we can't really expand anything at the moment. Oh, uh, at first, let's connect up the coal at least, so we can uh, start uh, collecting it. There we have it. We have the coal connected now. All right, so uh, all around, uh, I could do the same setup like over here, but uh, had a few issues uh, because we uh, built uh, too near to the uh, inputs. Maybe I will reroute it uh, sometimes, but at the moment it uh, stays like this. And over here, this is uh, quite a mess over here. As you can see, let's let climb up a bit. So yeah, as you can see, <laughs> uh, a bit um, conveyors. So here we uh, only used very short ones. So, so yeah, but uh, overall, uh, this looks epic indeed. So uh, let's check on our reinforced iron plates production. Okay, so the bottleneck is definitely iron plates over here. I just added uh, 50 over here. But yeah, uh, you can see that clearly that the wire is uh, enough at the moment and, and the plates are not. And the production itself is quite slow uh, also. Maybe we will, we will need to add a few more samples. But uh, let's check uh, on our uh, iron plates production. Okay, definitely not enough of ingots, and we only have five uh, constructors, to my surprise. So, uh, 
let's check on our uh, iron ingots then. Uh, oh, uh, we have uh, Mark 1 conveyor belt coming in from here, directly from the smeltery. Oh, uh, let's see about the upgrade maybe. Uh, yeah. Perfect, so let's upgrade this. Okay, <laughs> uh, we don't have any uh, reinforced iron blades, so let's let's uh, grab some and uh, deal with that. All right, managed to gather 83 of them uh, in total. So uh, let's check on our coal uh, setup also. Do we have a input? Yeah, perfect. This looks quite nice. Epic. So this, uh, yeah, four slots in here, more than enough and a few uh, coming in here also. So let's head back and uh, upgrade our iron ingot setup. Oh, by the way, uh, I I had an uh, almost an accident before uh, falling down uh, the tower. So let me see. Let's put this to express. Okay. So let's see uh, how can we demonstrate it. Okay, as you can see, the explorer is down there. So I. Uh, I fell down before uh, from uh, this length, uh, this height. So let's go. Uh, oh, not, not, let's not uh, go there. Let's uh, do it from here. And and I fell, fell, uh, fall down, uh, fell down. Yeah, fell down and managed to do to do this. So let's see if we can redo it again. Yep. Perfect, indeed. So uh, I left a little trick over here. So. Uh, so yeah, very fast uh, delivery. All right, all upgraded to Mark II. Now we should uh, be getting uh, twice the amount of iron uh, as before, as compared to the before amount, basically. Mm. So this one is Mark I going to the raw production. So this this is uh, okay at the moment. Yeah, this is this isn't uh, very efficient uh, at all because. Uh, we're only using the 120 per minute from here, but uh, but yeah, no worries. Uh, well, uh, we're building, uh, the resources can accumulate and we can build again, so yeah, no worries uh, whatsoever. And it looks nice also uh, having only one output at the moment. Alright, so, uh, so what was the agenda? Yeah, I think at the moment uh, this uh, should be enough for the uh, journey today, so uh, so yeah. I provide weekly gaming content in YouTube for free. I would be forever grateful if you could check out my merch. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, leave a like and subscribe for more content like that. Make sure to click on the bell so you can get a notification about future uploads. See you on the next one.